I need to save it, put it in the cart. I need to save it. Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I am at Highway 37 Flea Market. It's right here in Bedford, Indiana. And let's go see what we can find today. Let's just see and mark. Oh, is this a baby? Oh wow, he's been dirty. Look at these girls. These are cool. $12 for the three. Are you a baby? Oh, little baby. There's some snow babies. Oh, there's a little. He's $5. I don't know if that's $5 for just him. What are these? Paul laser for your cat. Laser. Laser light thing for your cats. Anything? Brass knuckles? Nah. Big bands. Cadillac sings the big band. Swings out with the big. I think that's a. Looks like an eight track. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh no. Well, this is pretty. Those are like paper flowers up there. It's $14. That's pretty. That's not though. What's that? It's interesting. Oh gosh, here's some cow mugs. Emma likes the cows. Looking through some of these records, I like these kind of obscure ones from the 60s. Kind of fun to listen to. This one's got like Sleigh Ride in Paris in the Spring. I did find a couple Frank Sinatra albums. Al Hurt and his band Saturday Night with Mr. C. Harry Belaf Belafonte, The Mamas and the Papas, Dying Ashore. So I like to find some of these. Oh, there's Pal Joey. Some of these obscure ones. They got a lot of belt buckles. Lots of belt buckles. Texas Paint Horse Club. I can imagine wearing a belt buckle that big. Plushies. Let's see what's over here. In this booth. Well, that's interesting. The bookends that were made out of the shoe forms. That's kind of neat. $32. We got some high Z glass, granite ware, Shawnee, milk glass. $12 for that book. I see, I need to take a little stock of some of the books that I have. I do like to buy price guides. Mm. Metal hang up drum. Oh, it's a little moth. You can hang it up and kill your moths. It's uh, $12. Some aluminum cups for fourteen. Ooh, we got some brooches. They're four dollars each. Oh, that bird one's kind of pretty. What's this? Bluffed Grand and Noble Order. Of what? It's like of Grant and Noble Order of the Button Busters. What are the Button Busters? Is this Sewing Susan's Lodge? Hmm. Some secrets in that book. It's four dollars. I don't know. Maybe that's a great deal. I've never heard of the Button Busters. Let me know. Do you know what the Button Busters are? Oh, here's some more books. I'm looking for a Viking book. Postcards. A railroad. General store. Drinking glasses. Hall pottery. I've got a lot of these. But I need that. I'm looking for a Hot Wheel one and a Viking. Those are the two that we're really looking for. Oh, what's oh not that. Hat pins. South Park. What are these? Flowers of Hawaii. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. These are $2 each for these postcards. Rookwood. I love Rookwood. Flashlights. Hmm. No Viking, no Hot Wheels. Do you ever... I had to do that, you know. This is a little tobacco jar. A little wooden tobacco jar for $5. Let's 
Looks like it still had a little bit of tobacco in it. What's over here, Mark? Anything good? Oh, this is pretty. This teal dish. It's $6.95. I love that color. I think I might get that. But I love that color. This is just a creamer. I don't well, if it had the sugar that went or the sugar roll that went with it, I might get that. But here we got the coffee house. Mom and Dad. Milk glass mugs. But I am gonna get this. I think it's pretty. Okay, here's a pretty little art glass bowl. It's six dollars. It's got some bowl of concierge, these controlled bubbles in it. Sanded down bottom. It's very pretty, very organic looking, like water. So I think I might get that for six dollars. Cute little set here. Instant coffee. It's got the spoon. Um, the coffee is eight ninety five, and then we've got the grease and the salt and pepper, which is an interesting combination. It's thirty two dollars. Little toy section here. We've got Wonder Woman. She's a cheetah. WW84 Wonder Woman. I have never heard of that. You just never know what you're going to find at the flea market. Just all kinds of stuff. DVDs. Games. Sandberg Bigwood Blocks. He's happy to play his blocks. That little kid is. Oh, look at Shellefin's little friends. The ducks. So I just think I like about flea markets so much is you just, oh, I thought that was a person standing there. It scared me to death. What is that? Oh. Just don't ever know what you're going to find. These are $5. I think, do these like all, do they go together? Do you know what I mean? Like, do they like play sounds together? This is, requires batteries. So we've got Mickey on the saxophone and on the keyboard. But I want to say that they kind of work or they play together. I don't think they have any batteries in them though. This is a little Shawnee planter there for $1.99. Oh, it's got a crack on it though, unfortunately. Hmm. Little babies. Some pink depression glass. I typically don't buy pink depression glass unless it's just like an unusual shape or size. Um, this doesn't sell well for me. We got a princess pig. Oh, we got some. There's a green schwan. Let's see if we've got any fun pieces of jewelry in this locked cabinet. Little chickens for $8.95. That little magnolia pin's pretty for $5.95. But let's see anything that I have to have. <gasps> Look what Mark just found. This is Viking. Oh, put that in the cart, sir. It was $10.95 and they marked it down to $9.95. You're the who's the man today? It's you. We're done. No. No, it's not time to go home, but that was a good find, Marcus. That was a good find, Marcus. He's a good picker. Just to show that they are still out there. That's the beauty about going to flea markets, guys. Ooh, this is pretty. That's lovely. It's very delicate and thin. It's $8. That's as much as the fairy lamp, almost. Well, let's see if we can find any more fairy lamps on these shelves over here. The candles, oh, they're candles. Well, here's some Ellie Smith Moon and Star. I think we'll get that as long as there's no boobers on it. I think we'll get that too for $8.95. Oops. I'll have my boober checker check it out for boobers. I know that sounds bad, but he knows what I mean. There's boober holders right there balls you found a boober yeah. Aww. where right there well i think that that is 
Yeah, I think it's a tiny boober. It's not on this one, but do you want it now? No. Good, good eye though, Mark. All right, I see a bunch of books down here I'm going to have to look through. I found a few books. Mumpsy Goes to Kindergarten, How to Be a Grouch, Garfield Goes Underground, Little Miss Sunshine, a couple little Care Bears books from 1984, The Playful Little Dog, and The Kitten Secret. So they're 50 cents each. So I'm going to get these. Look at that butter churn. That fan's kind of neat there, too. This is a nice dresser here, too. They do have some really nice furniture here. Really. We're just going to go look at the cars. and Lots of nice crates. I have several. What should they want for these crates, though? Because I do not have one. Um, I like that one. They're $15 each. Hmm. There's a turkey up there, too. Fishing poles, DVDs, lighters with girls on them. We have a couple shelves of some art glass items on it. This is $20. It's pretty, but I don't know how old that is. This is a pretty piece of cased purple. It's $8. Well, there's a little lamb. Fenton milk glass. I usually don't buy these. They're pretty common. There's the leaning tower of Pisa. Right there. Look at that. That's a filler little down there, I do believe, from the Rugrats. Well, look at this little cookie jar. <laughs> He's cute. He's got a broken foot, though, but it's kind of kind of weird. Kind of weird, kind of cute. There's a little cow creamer. She's got a repair, too. Let's see what else we can find. There's some Longa Burger pottery, which I don't really buy. This is pretty. That applied handle on it. 15. So, Mark found a... What, was what is it? Oh, yeah, this right. Yeah, Atari, and it's got all these games in it. Lots of games for 30. I think we should get it. I think it might be kind of fun to see if it works. You want to try it? Maybe. Might be kind of fun to play. What's this? That one's 25. So is that... Uh, there's more games it's there, too. 25, 25 for, for everything. And then 30 for this. There's a PlayStation there, too. So this might be interesting. I'm collecting a little display of lava lamps behind me, and I'm finding them just at garage sales and flea markets. And this one's $2, so I think we're going to... We're gonna add this to my little collection there. All right guys, we just finished up in Highway 37 and now we're gonna go right over there. Right over there to Riverside Antiques, let's go. All right, here we are at Riverside. Let's go see what we can find today. Looky over here, we got babies in a, in a thing. These colors are so pretty. All together, here is the bottom of a fairy lamp. Does it go? Another bottom of a fairy lamp base there too. Oh, no, well, yeah, but they're, they're mismatched. Oh my goodness, looky here. We've got some red birds. I think we'll get those. We've got this like purpley one. I think we'll get that one. Here's a squirrel. My word, it's like the little, the little bird. It's Ron Ray. Oh my goodness. Leo Ward. What are you? You're Joe Rice. I mean, I think we're just going to get all the birds today. We're going to get the birds. So this is a um, Ellie Smith. A 22. That's not too bad of a price on that. But this is kind of fun too. But yeah, there's a fairy lamp there. But we, we, we stocked up on some birds. There's more over here. There's one here. How much is this one? 12. And this one is also 12. Oh, look at you. Oh, I like you. Okay, so we're going to... Oh, there's two of you. Well, why is one of you 7 and one of you... One of you uh, 10? We'll have to ask about that. These Christmas trees do pretty well. 
it's, this one's ten dollars so i think i'm gonna get the christmas tree i may end up getting those but the, wow look at those blue bowls yeah too, and here's some waves for five dollars i think we'll get those too look at this this is a pretty bowl compote bowl for 15. there's also this ellie smith for 10. i think i'm going to get the ellie smith today because i have a green one as well so i think i might pair those up i typically just buy the ones that well this one is signed and it has the sticker on it but you can see they're all different sizes and their bases are all different so and they all have good beaks i don't know look at this little goober they're having a little meeting over here. But then this pink phone is $18. Is it vintage? I do believe it is because it is. Nope, this is a reproduction pink phone. It's still very cool, but I'm not going to get it since it's not an older one. Oh my gosh, look at, look at that pink poodle. I think this is a more modern piece too. My gosh, look at the squirrels. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. We're at least gonna get one of them. We're gonna get one. Look at this. I sold his brother just the other day. He's in great condition. We're gonna get him for fifteen. This Tanala or Mexican pottery from the bouquet barn. Looks like it's made in Mexico. It's ten dollars. I do like that. I like the colors on it. Ay ay ay. This is a fun postcard. Hi, sexy. I don't know what you've got, but I'll take an armful. Hubba hubba. This is fun too. This little um, 1975. Oh, it's not for sale. <laughs> but I do like this Las Vegas glass for three fifty with all those casinos that are no longer with us. My word, here's a little play. Oh my God. You know what? I have his, I have a partner for him. I have his buddy. Oh, good grief. Look at these. They are Kelvins. All right, I'm gonna get those. Oh my gosh. This is Viking. The shaggy dog for ten. I might wait on you. Um, what's down here? We've got the peacock down there. We've got some raccoons for five with their bushy tails. I sold their rabbit friends just last night. There's another little pixie planter there, and down here. And what is this? A tiki candle burner. Look at these goobers. Look at those little sun catchers. Those are adorable. Oh, it's four dollars. It's a little roached out though, isn't it? But it, I need to save it. Put it in the cart. I need to save it. They're getting harder to find. They're getting a lot more expensive. All right, we're going to get these two little goober guys down here. That's a Shawnee for 16. He's cute. I like these guys. These, oh, I see bear. Oh, I had those skates. I had these skates. Oh, memories. There's a Lucite. Oh, wow. Does this glow? Yeah, it has uranium in it. Look hey. at the bee. Yeah. Yeah, it has some cadmium. It does have some flores pieces in there, but that's $10. That's fabulous. I'm going to get that. And then, oh, Mark Shine, that's Vaseline. <gasps> yeah, that is unusual. It's just a little bitty little trinket. It's 15. I'm going to get that. How much are you, buddy? You are 20. But man, you know, he doesn't glow. <laughs> I know. Yeah, it's a, it's a clear glass one. I'm not really buying those at the moment. I think I actually have a couple more that I need to sell. No price, though. That's on the side. Oh, there's a junk jar. 
15 not a bad price it's a great price but I'm I'm definitely gonna get that as well this is a little little uh, carnation ceramic it's probably made in Italy it's pretty this is nice too it's 29 the orange moon and star this is Viking little mini Viking swung base for 12 she, she's got pretty good junk jars I bought one of our junk jars before so I am gonna get that one she's got some pop beads in there all about the plant marks marks already left me mark I got more stuff look at the little goober riding the snail he's two dollars he's cute but these are nice too I love those little fringy tablecloths. This one's 14. Oh my gosh, they've got faces. They're little anthropomorphic pots and pans for $6. Cat pillowcase for $10. Yeah. His and hers for 6 Get those two. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Look at the little Burger King cup. Made in USA. That is like 1972 Burger King. The old logo on. Yep, yeah, there it is, 1972. For $3. I might get that just because it's just advertising and I like it. The Five Little Raccoons. Oh, Monkey Shines coloring book. This one has been colored in. Um, I think these have all been colored in. I typically just try to buy the ones that have not. I've got great graphics on them though. But I am trying to be a little bit more picky with my ephemera because I have a lot of it. W. Chuck Family. So this is $4 doesn't have colored pictures in it. Oh my gosh. Look at this. The four little kittens. Buzz, Fuzz, Zuzz, and Agamemnon. As is. I wonder how yeah, it's been colored on, but that's hilarious. Well, we found some cool stuff today, both at the Highway 37 flea market as well as here at Riverside Arts and Antiques. So if you are in the area, make sure that you do stop in to both right next door to one another. Thank you so much for watching and following along with us. If you're not subscribed, I would love to have you subscribe to my channel. Please hit the little bell to be notified every time I upload a video. And until next time, bye guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one we need. Red hot mama, some charmer.